It's the YouTube channel for Earth, Wind and Fire. Better get rid of that video or else there'll be a copyright claim. Suck your mum. Justice for Cutsy. Go suck your mum. Suck your mum. Go suck your mum. Go suck your mum. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. Spell incorrectly. We've got Castaneda. He comes from Venezuela. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. We've got Castaneda. Why is everyone saying suck your mum? Who the fuck is Cutsy? Suck your mum. Suck. Go suck your mum. Suck your mum. Go 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 suck your mum. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. Cutsy represent. Go suck your mum. 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 Jesse, you're a fucking shithead low life asshole. Congratulations, hope you're proud. I don't think Alan knows exactly what's happened. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. Go suck your mum. Deborah, go suck your dad's ass. Deborah, Deborah, with the fire reply. Suck your mum. 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 Hashtag cuts the army. Don't really use that hashtag, but I'll take it. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. Stop saying that. <laughs> Deborah's back again. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. This has got three replies. What? what? Man's got 105 likes. Someone said what? Just a full stop. I don't get it. Can someone explain? Alex Donga, whoever you are, you need a medal. Cutsy, you are mom gay. What even is the point of your comment? Da fuck you good bro. Suck your mum. Casting you for life, mother suckers. Go suck your mum. Suck it. It just carries on. It's all the way through. Why do balls suddenly appear Every time the hose clear The perfect run He's one on one The hose through housekeeping has been done. Sat down to record this a couple of hours ago, but we've gone through all the comments of the previous episodes, all the customization that has been coming in from the patrons, and the random comment competition. And now we are up to speed, we are ready, so let's go through everything that's happened. Let's start with our customization competition. That was won by Cybergirl8. It was a fantastic comment, actually, talking about the War of the Roses in four 1485, and that's the reason why Rose has got the kit number 85. So much detail, really glad that it won so well done to Cybergirl 8. Let's move on to the patron customizations. Harvey Hall customized by Kyle has the number 24. Ugh. So if Harvey Hall is what we think he's going to become, he's going to be the first absolute superstar that doesn't wear the number 10 on his back. Kasten Yadar looking fresh, customised by Benito. He wanted different boots, but these are unique boots that you can't select from the menus, and I really like them, so we're going to keep them for the time being. This last one proves that I really have read every single comment. Some lad pronounced this guy's name. Knows how to pronounce it, because he's from the same neck of the woods. Bjorn running. Kit number 90 got some unique Nike bright yellow boots that really stand out. And that's that. Okay. On with the chants. Defenders don't like him. You Kawike. You Kawike. Magnusson. Son, son. He's our Swedish wonder kid. Magnusson. Son, son. Probably wanted by Madrid. To the left, to the right. Buzz defenders third degree. Stefan plays out of spite. Cause he's not from Djibouti. Kude, kude, kude. It must be kude. In the Lincoln net. Wake me up. Before you go, go, who needs VT when you've got Yuko? Yuko EK is a very popular man. Give me a haiku. Welcome to Yuko EK's Haiku Chronicles with your host, Yuko EK. EK destroyed them. Accrington Bastard Stanley. No haiku needed. 
That haiku was submitted by Steve Oh My Goodness 7. I wrote down another chant, but I think it needs a bit of fine tuning, so I scribbled it out in the, the book of chants there. Once I feel like this one's ready, I'll start writing it down, but yeah, I mean, look at this. It, it's just a work of art now. I have wrote essays worse than this. Defender don't like him. You go eat gay, you go eat gay. Harvey Hall is rested for this FA Cup clash against Crew Alexandra. The December fixtures hitting home hard. Whilst you're looking at our team selection, some people are putting backstories in the comment section. Now, I don't mind that at all. I might even pick up on some. I just haven't done it right now because I've needed to get a video out tonight, even though it's going to be extremely late. I feel like our chances in this match are going to be good, and the reason for that, Crew Alexandra's stamina levels low, as not bad. So the longer we keep this at maybe 0-0, 1-0 to Crew Alexandra, we have a chance. Off goes Phillips from the right-back spot. Now Mason. Ollie Mason looking around, trying to do the long diagonal there. But no one's available for him, so he has to go backwards. Martin. Here's Castaneda. 1-2 with Rose. Nearly goes for Castaneda. Kiroga with the ball. Now, I've been playing a lot of online FIFA recently. You probably see it with that terrible loss of possession. It's Ainley with a chance that he's took to put Crew Alexandra in the lead. Oh, so you're just going to give Castaneda room. Well, Castaneda's going to make you pay. Thank you. It's a quick reply from Elegio Castaneda and Lincoln City. Just having to get used to this again because the AI plays so differently compared to a human. Terrible in defense, but so good on the attack. I'm all for playing this game without Harvey Hall because I'm hearing silly talk that Lincoln are just a one-man team. Oh no, we're more than a one-man team. The 23 other clubs muttering. Oh, Lincoln City won't be anything without Harvey Hall. Well, guess what? We're drawing 1-1 against Crew Alexandra. There is some proof there that we can do it without the big lad. The amount of possession that we've had through this game, outstanding. The, the fact that we can't get through Crew Alexandra, a bit displeasing. Kiroga. Go on, look at the space! Kiroga! He might not be one for scoring the long shots, but you don't give any of my midfielders a chance like that, because guess who's on the controller? This guy! Go, Robinson, go! Run for me, Robinson! So here's to you, Isaac Robinson! Very large, you more than you will know! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Tackle! Oh! Super Cooper! Your tackles! Oh, so timely. Martin, boom, and again. Nice, nice. They just can't get the ball off us. Castaneda, Kiroga, yes, and again, Castaneda. That would have been a sensational goal. Just the movement, man. That's Oblovici. Kiroga, oh, Kiroga. He just wanted a second. Can we get it? Really? We've not got that thing out. We've wiped off. That Kiroga strike, the wonder goal that we've just seen, through just stupid defending. Right here, I'm pressing X for the tackle. And what does this lad do? Who is it? I don't even know. Clock! He tries to pass it. This is an X tackle. And he's like, here you go, Cooper, have some of that. Scrappy football, disappointing if you're a Lincoln City fan. Due to how good the team has performed, up to that point, Ollie Mason, he's not living up to the chant, a 10 out of 10 chant, but no 10 out of 10 performance since. They've got the lead, it's 3-2. Boss, we've got Harvey Hall on the bench, why aren't you using him? No, we're not using him, I really want to prove myself, but this is not a one-man team, it so is, it so is. Castaneda, come on. Ollie Mason, shut me up, Ollie Mason, that'll do, Castaneda knocks in the rebound and it's 3 all. that could have been the last attack, the last opportunity for Lincoln City to save the day. I think we're going to go to a replay, another game against Crew Alexandra, 
on the horizon. Ai ai, we got Castaneda. Ai ai, it comes from Venezuela. Ai ai, it's a joy to watch him play. Well, we've got the answer. When Harvey Hall is injured and unavailable to play, then we have to wrap up Castaneda in cotton wool bubble wrap. Anything that protects him, because he is the only one who knows how to score. Frequently. I see Harvey Hall's long shots are up to 70. Yeah, let's try them out. Good job that there's no one that we can bring up in these scout reports because I don't have any money to bring them up anyway. Patrick Green is an obvious candidate, but we already have a Charlie Green, so he's out of the running, the Bjarne running. We'll take a second look at Surge for Fauna in January. The other lad, nah. So we'll just keep this guy, the only person that we're kind of interested in, in the scout reports. And even then, we'll have to wait until January because we need money from somewhere. Maybe the first sales of the series are about to happen. Barnet have a 47 overall centre mid regen here. His name is Hughes and he looks garbage. EK's back from his injury. It's Lincoln City against Barnet. Whoop, 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 whoop. Yo, go, EK, baby! Wear me up before you go, go. Who needs Vitty when you got you go? Oh, lovely sunlight. Let's get a thumbnail here. Who should be on the thumbnail? Perfect. Screenshot done. I can't believe they've got this knockoff of Kinde playing Akinola and they're not got the true thing. Like, there's another player called Akindele and it's like, well, you're not Akinde, mate, so what are you doing with that name? And before you start talking silliness, like it's their surname, they have it from birth, they can't change it. Yes, you can. Shut up. I would pay to get my name as far away from Akinde as possible. You're not allowed to be happy with that surname. Do you want Akinde knocking at your front door? You're mine, Brinley. Come on, they're gonna line something up. A complete air shot helps us out. Here is Vilho, not in the game so far, but Vilho already showing that close control. I love him. Castaneda! Oh, there was Yuko Ike. Flashed across his face, but he had a selfish moment there and wanted to protect his perfect haiku brain. Rumours are that he can make three haikus per minute. That is seriously impressive. Kude. And again, you gotta do it again. Kude. Big save. Kude, Kude, Kude. It must be Kude in the Lincoln net. No. Oh, deflection and Kude somehow stopped it. Cooper guards the ball well, takes it away. Unbelievable from Kude at the end of the first half. Kude, 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 Kude. Da, 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 da. This ball is travelling at some speed, gets a really heavy touch and it probably helps the goalkeeper more than hinders him. I want more from this Lincoln City attack in the second half, but it's very difficult against five defenders. And uh, here come Barnet. That's in. Finally, they've got a goal. They broke us down. Barnet eyeing up. A second goal, it's Nichols, it's the same result, Nichols has bike two. We've got nothing to come, it's like being swarmed. Uh, Harvey Hall already has two players on him. Castaneda has to go backwards. Villaho. Oh! The Villaho cross was exquisite. We've been shouting out, we've been yearning for something like that and Harvey Hall Unfortunately, I think trying to go for placement instead of power. Kude, good save. Yuko Ike, good ball into Castaneda. And there's a run through on the hole! I couldn't shoot! I couldn't shoot! I was tapping circle and it didn't allow me to shoot. And now they've given a free kick to Barnet. Barnet did the dirty on us, they sat back, they played it defensive. You know what, I think that might be the way to play us this season. No, seriously guys, there's a lad here, Takeshi Higashi, we could sign him up. Lincoln City's home stadium would truly be Takeshi's castle. He's a regen and everything. Wow! It's Crow Alexandra again! I know reunions are all good and that, but three in such a short amount of time is overkill and no you're not looking at it wrong 
It's Harvey Hall at centre back. I wonder if I've still got the Tom Evans music somewhere. Ainley is going to get swallowed up by Roberts, but the pass from Roberts was really loose. Cue the music if we have it. If we don't have it, this is going to be awkward silence. Oh, unlucky by Harvey Hall. His first Tom Evans run it was pretty good. He got into the final third. Goal! Ollie Mason save! That was a huge save. I'm sure Garrett doesn't have a tash like that. Phillips. Oh, it's got to be a penalty. It has to be a penalty. How stupid. The right back was going nowhere. I mean, he's a right back. He's not going to shoot. Oh, they've took the arrow off. Oh, no. The, the new patch must have taken the arrow off. Oh, dear. Castaneda. Oh, it doesn't matter when you've got Castaneda on the ball. Whoa! Very nice. And I've got celebration in front of them Lincoln City away fans. Yes, Castaneda. It's Rui Faria. Come on, lad. His name is Rui and he dances on the wing. That's mine. Thank you, Roberts. Green. Rui, where has this energy come from? Rui Faria. He's seen that Vilho is here to take his spot and he's like, no, no, no. We're not having this. It might be time, lads. He's refilled his energy bar and he's off Harvey Hall. Come on. Castaneda, chip up. Oh, oh Castaneda, if only that went top corner. Harvey Hall coming at you, you better get rid. It's Roberts now against Dagnall. It's a low ball in. Burnson there. We'll just roll this out. Harvey Hall got pressure immediately. Even at centre-back, they know that he's a risk. He's a danger that needs to be sorted out quick. Oh, we've lost it. That was a lazy pass there. Harvey Hall. Oh, he's forgot the art of defending. The ex-Lincoln City star. Dagger in the hearts to his former team. Must defend, but must also keep running with Harvey Hall because that is just in my nature. Harvey Hall! And still, he's going better this time. Harvey Hall! Castaneda mops it up! And I think that's a hat-trick for the lad. Excellent reactions. Attacking display here from El Gio Castaneda. Aye, aye, we get Castaneda, aye, aye, he comes to Venezuela, aye, aye, Matip showed him the way. Immaculate performance there from the Venezuelan. Free kick, another whole wall. Oh, it's an incredible save by Burnson. Roberts and the other lad, I think it was Latov Lovici, getting each other's way. Oh, oh, stretching to make sure that the shot was so difficult for the lad. And I think we just about managed it. Tackle! Ugh, Harvey Hall's defensive problems showing again. I think now it gets megged. There's a paper bag in the corner, mate. Just use it. Cooper, three, two, Kirk, run! Who's this? Martin, who's not even a centre bike by nature. It's pro this is the problem, isn't it? Cooper equalises. We've got a central defensive midfielder and a right bike playing at centre back with each other. The inexperience is showing, and it's another 3 3 scoreline here with Crew Alexandra. Alright, like, get into the middle. This is our chance to win it. We play into Castaneda with the fake shot. This is it! Castaneda is on fire! We now know the difference maker, and his name is Cast... Ah, he only scored three, so who scored the other one? Oh, it was Rui Faria! Oh, no! I completely forgot Rui Faria scored, which means that all my commentary in this game, total mess. Kind of shows how much of a nobody Rui Faria is, doesn't it? I'm so sorry! This is one of these moments, you know, when you just want to put your head in your shirt and you're like, nah, I'm not here lads, it's someone else. We're gonna play Crew Alexandra four times in a month. Can we have this fixture move please and just play someone else? 
New Year's Eve. Well, lads, that will be it for another episode of Youth Squad Legends. Thank you ever so much for watching. If you've enjoyed it, then please give the video a like. If you're not subscribed yet, then please do so. Hit the red button and hit the bell for mobile notifications because you want to know exactly when a Youth Squad Legends video is uploaded. See you next time.